Quadrilaterals. Four sides. But none of them are congruent. And there's four angles. But none of them are congruent either. And all the diagonals, they have different lengths. And they don't bisect. They don't bisect. Yet, the angles, they equal 60 degrees. But how can they possibly equal? 360 degrees! And then there's a parallelogram. Four sides. Opposite sides and angles are congruent. And that diagonals are congruent too. Don't forget the bisect. 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 <laughs> Squares. Squares. Sides and angles are congruent. The diagonals are perpendicular. <laughs> the angles. Equal 90 degrees. All of them. They all do. Rectangles have 490 degree angles too. Wow. The opposite sides, they back a grind and the diagonals by sight. And they also make perpendicular lines. 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 Rhombus looks awfully like a square, but Jerome, they don't have right angles. <laughs> they're all obtuse or acute. <laughs> all sides are equal like a square. And then the consecutive angles are congruent. What? 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 But the diagonals are congruent, okay? The diagonals being congruent, okay. And then, this isosceles trapezoid, where both the consecutive sides and consecutive angles are congruent. Kites have consecutive sides, too. <laughs> but they're angles. <laughs> The opposite lines are congruent. And finally, the triangles are not equal. And they don't bisect. Bisect.